Well, Secretary of Homeland Security Alejandro Mayorkas is praising the Supreme Court decision to toss the lawsuit by two Republican-led states. They challenge President Biden's targeted deportation policy. Mayorkas says it will allow ICE officers to focus on migrants who pose a threat to the country. Al Fox's Lucas Tomlinson is in Washington tonight with more. A big win for the Biden administration. In an 8-1 to one ruling, the Supreme Court rejecting a challenge by Texas and Louisiana to lift President Biden's targeted deportation policy. At the center of the case, the two states arguing federal immigration law requires authorities to detain and deport all illegal immigrants, putting a huge financial burden on local law enforcement agencies for what they say is a lenient federal deportation policy. That policy put a priority on deporting migrants who most recently crossed the border and those who pose huge risks to public and national safety. Texas is spending close to 10 billion dollars to deal with the crisis and chaos caused by the Biden administration. But the vast majority of justices determined the Republican-led states did not even have the standing to sue over the administration's 2021 policy. The opinion, penned by Justice Brett Kavanaugh, saying deporting some 11 million immigrants is unrealistic. Quote, the executive branch invariably lacks the resources to arrest and prosecute every violator of every law and must constantly react and adjust to the ever-shifting public safety and public welfare needs of the American people. We're still waiting on roughly 10 rulings from the high court, notably those on affirmative action and student loans. Those rulings could come as early as Tuesday. In Washington, Lucas Tomlinson, Fox News.